Hey guys, so I am having a little me day, um, <laughs> a self, not like self care, but like mental health day. Um, so it's Monday and I am off today. I do have to go in to work, um, at 530 to be tested for the virus. Um, it's required now that all healthcare workers get tested so um where i work we're all being tested today we had to pick a time so um i picked 5 30 but um yeah so carl is at work and my parents are watching oakland i just dropped her off um i just this week has been so stressful the past three days at work has been mentally draining just everything going on it's so stressful and this week we were supposed to go on vacation we we're supposed to leave um, Friday night. So I think that um, that we actually canceled our vacation because of everything that's going on. Um, we probably still would have went if we didn't have Oakland, but I just, we decided it just wasn't worth um, taking her out there. Um, and things weren't all the way opened up anyway. So I feel like it just wouldn't have been probably enjoyable and like who in the world wants to wear a mask out when it's like 100 degrees at the beach it's like oh my gosh i have to wear a mask for 12 hours at work i'm like outside of work i don't want to go anywhere to have to wear a mask because that's torture but so today i'm just taking time for myself i just asked my parents if they could watch her today so i could just take some time for myself so i gotta pick up a couple groceries um and I got to clean the house. I got to do some laundry. Um, just run a couple errands. Watch some TV and just relax to get, like, <laughs> my anxiety down. Because my anxiety is through the roof. I just, yeah, it's just crazy. I'm just, I want things to go back to the way they were. Because, I don't know. It's just like, I don't know. Every day is so stressful anymore. But, yeah, it looks like it's going to rain today, so I'm going to hurry up and get some errands done. It's like 8.25, so hurry up and do that before it rains, and then hopefully I can relax for a little while before I go back and pick Oakland up. So, see you later. All right, just got back from getting some groceries. Um, I thought I'd share with you if you're interested what I picked up. Um, this is just from that grocery outlet that I've talked about before. Um, it's just right down the road from our house. And I like to go there um, probably like once every two weeks. I, I don't actually like get like lots of groceries there. It's just kind of like filler things, um, like snacky foods, just things that are cheaper than going to the grocery store. So and they always have just like random things and um, it's just kind of like fun to go and see what they have, but, uh, yeah, so I thought I'd just share with you real quick what I picked up. Um, they had some of this cat food. My cats have never tried this. I always give them the friskies, but, um, I thought I would try it just because they've been really picky lately. So maybe they'll like this and it was super cheap. It's only 34 cents for one of them, but, um, I just got these two flavors to see if they'd like it. Then I picked up two of these sugar-free Cool Whips. Um, I like these to make that fluff that I make. Um, yeah, two for a dollar, so that's super cheap. <laughs> and then um, I love these blue corn chips, um, and I like that they're in little individual bags. Easy to take to lunch or to work for lunch, um, but they were four for a dollar, so I got um, two dollars worth. Then I needed some more bananas. Um, they had some of these sugar-free mixes. I really like to have these at work. Um, I usually take like a water bottle with me and I can just throw this in and it helps me drink, um, water while I'm at work. So I've never tried these two flavors, but this is the Greenberry Rush. It looked good. It's like, looks like strawberry kiwi. And then this one is a lemon berry. So it looks like lemon and strawberry, like strawberry lemonade probably. Um, and those were two for a dollar. So that's super good. Um, these are normally a dollar at the store, so like buy one, get one free. I love a deal. <laughs> um, and then I got two things of eggs. I like getting eggs there just because they're cheaper than anywhere else. So I got two of those. And then I picked up more of these protein fiber bars. Um, 
I love these things. They're so good. And I am doing Weight Watchers, and these are only two points for one of these bars. So usually I'll have one of these like at nighttime before I go to bed. If I'm hungry, craving something sweet, um, I'll just grab one of these, and they're really good. So I got two of those. They were 99 cents a piece. Then I've really been wanting to try these Swiffer dry cloths because um, we have a dog and two cats. So there's constantly pet hair all over our floors and I literally have to sweep multiple times a day. So I thought um, maybe doing this might, um, maybe I could like vacuum up the litter and then use one of these. Um, maybe once in the morning and once at night. I don't know. I just wanted to try them and they were $2.99. So I think pretty sure that's cheaper than the store, but um, just to try them out. So I picked up one of those and then I got some of those pretzel stick packs. Um, those will be nice to take to work in my lunch. Those were 99 cents and it comes with 10 of them. So that's a really good deal. So I got two of those and then I got some fiber one bars. Um, I got the lemon and these were, I think like a dollar 49 or a dollar 99. Um, so a lot cheaper than going to the regular store. And then they had the mega packs, um, in the brownie, the chocolate fudge. And these were two 99. So, oh, and then I picked up, <laughs> this is random, but, um, these are Dugan donuts, coffee cups, like for iced coffee. I bought these before there, um, probably a couple summers ago. And so I just make my own like iced coffee at home and just put it in one of these cups and put a straw in. And it, I don't know, it makes me feel like I'm drinking Dunkin' Donuts when I'm really not, but um, I don't know. It just, it's cheaper and I don't know. I'm just all about that. So it just makes me feel good that, I don't know, to have like a cool little cup like from Dunkin Donuts or I'll like save my Starbucks cup and use it a couple of times to make my own iced coffee at home. It makes me feel like I'm actually drinking Starbucks when I'm not, but all about a budget and tricking your mind into thinking that you're having something that you're not. <laughs> so yeah, that's my little grocery haul. And I think I'm going to go and do some laundry and clean the house. a video like a little haul i went shopping a couple weeks ago got some stuff for me in oakland so i thought i'd go ahead and share that with you so that's why i got ready <laughs> and then i got a message from work saying <clears throat> um that i could come in sooner to get tested i wasn't supposed to go till 5 30 but 
it's um about 20 to 1 so i'm gonna head over now and get it over with um i'm slightly nervous <laughs> i um i was tested for the flu like several years ago and i know it's the same process and i know what they do but anything that's like awkward like makes me nervous and things i haven't had done yet make me nervous you know so <laughs> over there and get tested and then I need to run to Aldi and Walmart to pick up Oakland's prescription just got a text that it's ready and then I need to run to CVS and then I think I'm gonna come home oh and I just made an iced coffee in one of my Dunkin Donuts cups so I am ready got my fuel I'm really tired I already had one coffee today but it's just not working out so I'm gonna head over there and I'll let you know how it went. Okay, I just had it done and <laughs> was slightly nervous because some of my coworkers were standing outside and they had already <laughs> had it done and they said it was bad. I was like terrified, but it wasn't bad at all. I mean, it just kind of, I don't know, just kind of weird, but it wasn't bad at all. So um, thank goodness, but so now I'm gonna head to Walmart to pick up a prescription, Aldi, CVS, and then go home and hopefully I can relax. This hasn't been much of a relaxing day. Been kind of stressful still. I still feel like my anxiety is kind of high, but I just want to relax, lay down and watch some lifetime. Honestly, that's always what makes me feel better. So hopefully I can do that when I get up. I just need it back from Aldi. I thought I would show you what I got there. Um, almost done with my coffee. My dog's choking in the background. Um, okay, so I got two things of apples. I really like getting these kind of apples. Um, two things of veggie chips. I like to use those in my lunches. Um, this is the... Are you alright, buddy? Goodness. This is the bread. I like to use these sandwich um, sins sometimes. Got those. Um... Some lettuce, we need some more cooking spray, some chicken, that's for Carlo, um, some tortilla, tortillas. Oh my gosh, buddy, what is wrong with you? Um, okay, and then I got some, uh, this is what I put in the fluff. Um, I usually just do crushed pineapple, but the one time I couldn't, they only had one can left. So I bought that and then I thought I would put some oranges in it and I really like it that way. So I've been mixing half a can of that and half a can of this together. And then this is the pudding that I use, sugar-free, fat-free, um, with a Cool Whip, which I got earlier. Then I've been craving sushi. So I was really hoping that they had some and they did. I just got the California roll. And then this is probably gonna be maybe for dinner. I don't know, I might have it for lunch. Um, and save some for Carlo, but um, also this mochi ice cream. I've been wanting to get some of this forever, but they only ever had like the mango and the strawberry, and I just, I don't want either one of those. And then today I saw they had the chocolate, so it's like, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and buy it. <laughs> um, I haven't had this ice cream in so long, but that will be good. And then I got, I really wanna get the other ice cream bars that they had, because they're really low on Weight Watcher points. I think they're like, I think three or four points for one bar. So um, that's what a lot of times I would have at night. But um, I'm hoping these are low in points. Um, I'm gonna see. I got those. I got some grapes. And then I got a couple of things for Oakland. Um, these yogurt bites, which make me a little nervous. She's been doing okay with her puffs. Um, I was kind of like, breaking them in half and I was kind of like putting them in my mouth first and then giving them to her so that they were kind of soft because it just made me nervous that she was going to choke on them but now she can put the whole thing in her mouth and she's perfectly fine she does have two little teeth on the bottom so she um can crunch on them but um I just I've heard some crazy stories about these yogurt bites that um they can get lodged in their throats and I don't know it makes me nervous but um I think I'm gonna try it and I'll just obviously be with her when I give it to her, but um, just something different for her to snack on. And then I found this cute little toy. I almost bought this on Amazon one time, and then I kind of forgot about it, but it just, it reminds me of like a little Starbucks cup. So um, yeah, I thought she would, she likes to like mess with things, but hopefully she'll like it. She's obviously nine months old, but um, <laughs> I think she'll still like it. So 
that was like i think this was like 3.99 or 2.99 or something so um yeah aldi's always has like some random things but um yeah so that is my aldi's haul and i'm like exhausted i don't know what's wrong with me i'm so tired my head hurts i don't even know i'm just like i just want to lay down honestly but it's 2 30 and i need to put all this away and then i think i may watch some tv and try to relax a little bit before i go get her just because right now i just feel like crap so <laughs> Oh, so much for a relaxing day. It hasn't really been relaxing. I've had to like catch up on errands and clean. I still have to do laundry. And I mean, obviously I was able to get a lot done today, but still, I just really want to relax. So, hey guys. So I am about to end my day. It's 6.30. Um, I just went and picked up Oakland from my parents' house and she's downstairs playing. I don't know if you can hear. She's like... <laughs> doing her screechy voice um but yeah she's downstairs with carlo playing so i was like oh i did not get to relax like i wanted to today at all my anxiety is like still kind of high and i feel like i'm like constantly on my phone looking at social media like constantly and i feel like that does not help but it's almost like a nervous habit that if i'm like anxious or I feel nervous or I don't know I'm like constantly getting on it so I feel like I need to stop doing that so I'm like okay I'm gonna come up here for half an hour and tell her um oh, bedtime feeding and read a book and that I think will like calm me and I'll have a half an hour to just kind of relax so that's what I'm gonna do I've been honestly trying to read this book for like a month now it's um James Patterson was like my favorite author. I love reading his books. They're like murder mystery type of things, but I just love it. So I've been reading this one, but um, so that's what I'm gonna do. Hopefully you liked this video. It wasn't very relaxing, but at least I got a lot of things done today and um, I won't have to do tomorrow. So I don't work tomorrow. Thought that I did, but um, I guess I don't, so I will be home again tomorrow. I need to finish up laundry, though. That is one thing I need to do, and vacuum our couches because there's cat and dog fur all over them, and kind of have to do that a couple times a week, but um, I should be able to do that. I'll probably vacuum right after I feed her in the morning, and then uh, I'll just do laundry as soon as I wake up, so... Yeah, it won't be too bad, but hopefully it's nice. Probably just go hang out at my parents' house and swim. So maybe tomorrow will be a relaxing day. <laughs> I don't know, but um, yeah. So hopefully you like this. If you did, please give a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. I'd love to have you. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys. Ah! <laughs>